Prokaryotic cells are one of the most basic kinds of cells that are out there in biology. They are the cells of, of uh, bacteria. So let's take a look at what makes up the key characteristics of a prokaryote. Now their name tells you one of their most important things. Pro means before, kary means nucleus. So this tells you that this is what cells that evolved before the nucleus came about look like. So they do not possess uh, internal organelles inside their cells that have double membranes around them like the nucleus or the mitochondria or the chloroplast. Similarly, unlike eukaryotes, they only have one, or one chromosome in them and it's actually a circular molecule. Now it's called naked, not because it's going around there flashing the other organelles, it's because it does not have a lot of proteins wrapped around it to help organize it. Since they only have a little bit of DNA compared to a eukaryotic cell, there's no need for that kind of organization. Lastly, they have their own special kind of ribosomes that are different from the uh, eukaryotic style ribosomes that your cells have or plant cells or fungi. So let's take a look at the structure of a prokaryotic or bacterial cell. Now these labels here are a little bit small for you to see, but they give you the right basic idea. This is a kind of bacteria here, and you can see here's the DNA all kind of floating around inside the cytoplasm of the cell. Now they will have a cell membrane, but that is often wrapped in an external wall, sometimes called a capsule or um, cell wall. Now this can be made out of various, many, uh, various kinds of materials, whether it's bacterioglycan or, uh, sorry, bacteriopeptidoglycan or other kind of molecules. Um, you'll see the ribosomes, those are the small little things floating around, and then they may have a few other small organelles like uh, some small little vacuoles or vesicles, but that's pretty much it. The one thing that is a little bit different on the outside is they have flagella, much like our cells do, but our cells do this kind of motion called undulation. Bacterial cells, their fungi rotate like an outboard motor to make them go. And that's a prokaryotic cell.